They have categorized all of their tire lineup in a very simplistic form. Hey! I, I saw you break it and lose it, and I lost it. <laughs> What's up everyone, Mark here from Jensen USA, out here in our local trail, Sycamore Canyon, to give you a great video about none other than tires. Now we all know with tires that typically we're inundated with all kinds of options. What kind of tread compound do I want? What's the grip that I'm looking for? Well, we're here to bring you a video specifically looking at the Specialized tire lineup. And you may not have known, but Specialized started in making tires. Before they even got into bikes, it was three years before that, they started developing and making their own tires. Another great thing about Specialized and their tires is they own their own factory. What this does is it allows them to be firsthand in developing and reconstructing their compounds and all their tire features. They're able to immediately take it from their factory and change and transition things to make sure that they're providing for those out there riding the perfect tire to get you exactly what you need. The great thing about Specialized owning their own factory is they also have their own proprietary rubber blend. And what this is, is it is a rubber compound with activated silica. And this is a patented formula that they use in developing across their entire tire lineup. So let's first start by getting into the different tread compounds. All right, so Specialized has made it super simple with their tread compounds. They break it down into three different categories. They have their T5, their T7, and their T9. Letters and numbers, but let's get into them. The first one being T5. Now this is typically aimed at your cross country riding, your race style, you're gonna get a much more fast rolling and lighter tire, okay? But with this, you're gonna get a little bit harder of a rubber on your tread to keep you going. The T7 compound, is more specialized do it all. It's the all around trail tread compound that they use. This is gonna give you an equal amount of grip, durability, and rolling resistance. So if you're looking for the more do it all, the center balance, the T7 is the great idea. And lastly, for all you gnarly downhill, super enduro, crazy riders out there, Specialized has their T9. This is for you gravity oriented riders. You're gonna get more grip than you know what to do with, but it's gonna be a little bit less on durability. That rubber's softer. It's gonna grab and hold on like Jack held on to Rose and she said never let go. It's never gonna let go to that rock. So if you're looking for that super grip, get the T9. <laughs> I saw you break it and lose it and I lost it. <laughs> All right, now let's get into specialized tire casings. Now, similarly to their tread compounds, they have categorized all of their tire lineup in a very simplistic form. The first being control. This is aimed at your more cross country racing. It's gonna have 60 threads per inch for a nylon to give you a little bit better puncture resistance. It's got great sidewall protection, so you're not gonna get pinch flats. And it's overall provided for a lightweight tire to keep you rolling fast and racing hard. So next up in the casing formula, is Specialized Grid. Now Grid is your do-it-all, all-around casing here. It's aimed typically like the control, but a little more into the trail-oriented perspective. It's gonna be a little bit more aggressive. You're gonna get a little bit more knobbier grip here, a little bit heavier protection. Still, you're gonna have that pinch flat resistance, and it's gonna be another durable 60 TPI as well. So if you're looking for that more do-it-all, all-around, kind of equal balance casing, the Grid is your option. Next up in the category is Grid Trail. And you might be thinking, well, we just went over Grid. Well, Grid Trail is Grid Extra. It's the more aggressive version of the trail casing that Specialized offers. Now, this is gonna give you thicker sidewalls, which offers more pinch flat protection. It offers you 30% puncture resistance in the tire. You're still gonna get your 60 threads per inch casing, it's gonna be aggressive, it's gonna be thick, it's gonna be grippy. If you're looking for that more enduro gravity aspect, this is the tire casing for you. Moving next into here, we have grid gravity. Now this is that indestructible without that super heavy weight class 
tire casing that specialize offers. Grid Gravity, it's gnarly, right? This is your super strong, ready to tackle and smash rocks every single day and provide the grip and everything that you need casing that they provide. So if you're one of those riders that's out there and you're crushing the gnarliest terrain, but you don't want a full downhill tire, the Grid Gravity is a tire casing for you. And lastly, I just want to touch on it briefly, is the black diamond casing. This is for the top of the mountain, super gnarly downhill racers that are looking for the most indestructible, point it down and watch it roll type of tire casing. So if you're looking for that and you're that type of rider, black diamond is the tire casing for you. And now that we've gone over tread compounds and tire casings, maybe you're looking for a little bit more information and thankfully, we have another video where we're actually at Specialized and we're going over the tires with them themselves. So if you're looking for that in-depth knowledge on Specialized tires, be sure to check out the link and watch that video. Let's look at the actual tire models. And we're gonna start again with cross country. If you're a racer and you're looking to go fast, Let's start from the bottom. Right here we have the Renegade. The Renegade is typically aimed for your hard pack riding. It's meant to climb real fast. It's all about acceleration and strong braking. So if you're looking someone that's gonna be riding a ton of hard pack, you're looking to race real fast, climb hills faster than everyone around you, the Renegade is the tire for you. So the Renegade is perfect for fast accelerations and climbing in hard pack terrain. It has a fast rolling tread design with engineered knob blocks that enhance cornering traction and creates better braking effectiveness. All right, next up is the fast track. Now this is building a little bit off the previous Renegade model. It's basically still for your cross country racing, aimed a little bit more of hard pack or if you're racing a little bit on the loose over hard pack. Now this is basically a Renegade, or excuse me, this is basically yeah, the Renegade. <laughs> with the fast track here, it's a buildup of the Renegade. This is basically a cross country tire with a little bit more bite. It's gonna have a little bit more grip. And this is to tackle those really technical courses in your race. It still has fast acceleration, but a little bit more grip. As you can see in the tread compounds here and the patterns here, we're getting a little bit more aggressive. We're getting tighter feel. It's gonna provide you a little bit more control over those technical courses. The Specialized Fast Track takes the already proven tread design and puts a more consistent shoulder block for better cornering and traction, as well as having the block spacing configured to have better self-cleaning. Moving in to our last cross-country race tire here, we have the ground control. And it's exactly like the name states. It's to give you all the control on the ground. Ideally though, this tire is offering a little bit more grip. It's the all purpose, all conditions, cross country tire that Specialized provides. It's going to give you loose over hard pack, hard pack and even medium terrain condition control, optimal braking technology within the tread pattern. It's everything you need if you're looking for that all conditions, all terrain, cross country tire, the ground control. The Specialized Ground Control is their versatile trail cross-country tire. It has the features of the CAD engineered knob shapes, which provide for optimal braking performance and increased traction, while also maintaining the best possible ground control. So moving into Specialized Trail Tires. With Specialized Trail Tires, we're gonna get a little bit more puncture resistance and aggressive style knobs and design. So let's get into them. First up, we have Specialized Purgatory. This is their do-it-all trail tire. It's designed for your loose, loose over hard pack, medium terrain. This is gonna give you the most control that you're gonna get, the do-it-all, all-around tire that they offer for their trail performance. Now, if you can see on here, they have a more square knob pattern to design for a little bit more control and traction on the ground. The Specialized Purgatory Tire offers the redesigned square lugs that bite in the soft soil while still providing support on the hard pack ground. Additionally, the flexible center sipes fold out under braking force for increased ground contact and adhesion. 
All right, next up in the trail category is the specialized slaughter. Now this is your go fast, hit the corner, all you need type of tire. It's the heavy metal. And by that I mean the heavy pedal, super tight cornering tire that they provide. You got your square, low profile knobs in the center. This is gonna keep you rolling fast over hard pack. And the shoulder knobs here are up high like skyscrapers to keep you cornering tight in those sandy conditions. So if you're looking to roll straight and fast and corner hard, the slaughter's for you. Yeah. Excellent. The specialized slaughter has vertically stepped knob shapes for more knob core stability and additional biting edges. The center knobs roll over quickly for hard pack while the taller knobs grip in the looser, sandier corners. Moving into the last category of specialized tires is their gravity lineup. Now with the gravity lineup, this is for all you out there that are riding park, you're riding more enduro style, aggressive riding, and you're looking for that extra knob pattern, you're looking for that extra grip, these are the tires that are for you. So first up in the lineup is the Specialized Butcher. Now this is your total control, gravity oriented tire. This is gonna handle all the load that you need to keep you tight in the cornering. It's got wider aggressive shoulder knobs. It's got the thicker, more defined center knobs for handling down those fast trails. Typically with this tire and the Specialized, as you can see here on the Enduro, this is your front tire that you're gonna to wanna to run. The Specialized Butcher features wider shoulder knobs that provide better support under load and center blocks that have been staggered in space for a smoother transition when leaning the bike over. All right, next up here, we have the Specialized Eliminator. With the Eliminator tire, this is gonna roll fast and dig deep. This is typically your back tire. It's able to grab hard on the terrain and keep you spinning, right? You're not gonna lose traction. It's great for all the enduro riders or if you're looking for a little bit more downhill oriented without that full downhill weight that you're gonna get. The Specialized Eliminator tire combines the aggressive block design with well-balanced tread pattern. It has transition knobs that bridge the traditional channel between the center and shoulder knobs, and this makes for the perfect enduro riding in the rougher conditions. All right, so now here, like you see on my personal bike, I'm running the butcher in the front. It gives me the control I need through the cornering and the turns, it's everything that I need. As well as in the back here, I got the Eliminator. This keeps me gripping on the climbs, because even though it's an enduro bike, I still like to climb a little bit, make the legs work. So if you're looking for a great combo out there for when you're hitting the bike park, I recommend going Butcher in the front and Eliminator in the back. Last up in the lineup, we have the Specialized Hillbilly. Now this is aimed directly for that super wet, extra loose terrain when you're needing all the grip that you can get. Now, if I were out riding, it was super wet, it was a muddy condition, and I was looking for a little bit more control, I would take this hillbilly, I would throw it on my bike instead of the butcher, because it makes a great front tire if that's the kind of terrain that you're riding on. So if you're riding the wet, you're riding loose, and you're looking for more control, go with the hillbilly. The Specialized Hillbilly is designed to perform well in your wet and loose terrain. With the small center knobs, they increase the load on the ground and help surface penetration, while the shoulder knobs provide support in the fast turn on all surfaces. All right, so as we've gotten into all the tread compounds, the different casings, and the different tire line of the Specialized offers, we can see that they put a lot of effort and dedication into providing the best tire that you can put on your bike. So if you're looking for something cross country, we know what to look for. If you're looking for something and you're that more trail all mountain rider, we've gone over those. Or if you're the more gravity oriented, you're riding the bike park, you're super aggressive, we know what to look for with those. Well, I hope you liked this video, so make sure you like and subscribe. And why don't you leave us a comment below letting us know what your current tire setup is. Do you run the same tire front and back or maybe you have a mix max option like I'm running here on my Enduro. So make sure you leave us a comment. We're happy to reply. We'd love to hear from you. 
And maybe you have some more question about tires. So if that's the case, make sure to reach out to our Gear Advisor pros. These people, they ride hard, they know their products, and they're always happy to help. So reach out to one of them with any further questions you might have on any of the tires that we carry here at Jensen USA. And check it out, we love seeing y'all ride. We like to see your pictures, we like when you tag us. So make sure to follow us at Jensen USA across all the accounts, TikTok, Instagram, whatever it may be. Make sure to use the hashtags, hashtag Jensen USA or hashtag we keep you pedaling. We'll be sure to feature you on our accounts because we like to see it. And lastly, and always, keep pedaling. Hey! Comment below.